But here's a much more positive story to told in the water. Everyone has a hobby they turn to for enjoyment, and sometimes it even improves day to day living. One McChesney Park boy has made a remarkable improvement in his way of life, all through the love of scuba diving. 13 Sports reporter Sam Knox has a story you'll see only on 13 News. At first glance, Jackson Bosselman looks like your everyday seven year old boy, but his journey has been far from ordinary. When we first got that diagnosis, we were just heartbroken. Didn't know what we were going to do. I mean, you know, 40 hours of services on top of daily care. How are we going to do this? Jackson was diagnosed with moderate to severe autism when he was two years old and started going to therapy. He didn't really play very well. He didn't talk. He didn't really have a lot of communication skills. Um, he was frustrated by that. It was really hard for him to let people know what he wanted. And his mom was struggling with how to help him. His mom, Marcella, has a part-time job at Loves Park Scuba, where longtime friend Dan Johnson is the owner and a scuba instructor. Marcella decided to have Jackson give diving a shot. He was uh, very disruptive uh, when he'd come in. Ruby, our dog, she'd run the other way, and uh, he would make a lot of noises and so forth. In about 15 minutes, he'd wear his welcome out anywhere. After Jackson warmed up to the water and got used to scuba diving, he quickly found a love for it. But it's not just fun for Jackson. Soon after scuba diving, Marcella noticed something else. He's starting to talk. He was saying sentences and, you know, two words, three words. And the you know, therapist was like, yeah, that's, we're doing three word sentences. That's great. His communication skills drastically improved. Now, once he starts talking and he's comfortable, he is nonstop chatter. <laughs> I just sometimes you got Tom Jackson. Can you quiet down a little bit? Jackson has been scuba diving since he was three years old, and to this day, Jackson gets to Love Spark Scuba two to three times a week, and it's always highlighted on the calendar. I love it when I dive. It plays fun. I like scuba dive with my mom and mom. The question is, why does scuba diving help improve Jackson's communication skills? And could other water activities help other kids with disabilities? There has been a lot of research done on kids that have disabilities in swimming, um, particularly, like I said, swimming with dolphins and things like that. And I have had kids on my caseload who have gone and done that. It assists them with their mobility. I think that there's um, just some ability to sort of be a little bit more free and open to communication and sort of open to um, the activity. Jackson made so much progress through therapy and scuba diving that his kindergarten teacher didn't even know he had autism. She read it in the file. She, uh, When he was ready to graduate, she said that she would have never known that he had autism except for she saw it written in the file. It's remarkable. How much has Dan helped you? A lot. Hearing that he graduated from kindergarten mainstream is uh, really an accomplishment. From mom to Lisa to Dan, and of course, Jackson's incredible work ethic. This team was able to help improve Jackson's way of life and help him realize that the sky, or maybe the bottom of the ocean, is the limit. Reporting in Loves Park, Sam Knox, 13 Sports. Well, what a story there. Jackson continues to dive with his mom and Dan on a regular basis and is set to start first grade in the fall. Best of luck to him. Yes, love that story.